school. Today I'm going to teach you some additional vocabulary um, related to the house. Um, this is just kind of bonus vocabulary that you might use in some upcoming projects. So um, we're going to start in la chambre, in a bedroom, um, and I just wanted to pronounce these words for you so that you could hear um, what they sound like in French. So we have um, une armoire, ou l'armoire, uh, a lot of times in um, French homes, um, closets are not built in, um, and so you have an armoire or a wardrobe um, cabinet sort of thing that you keep your clothes in that's separate, not built into the wall. Uh, li, le rideau, le rideau ici, that's the, um, the curtain. L'ordinateur, it's a computer. Le bureau, a desk. Le livre is a book. Le jouet is just a general word for a toy. Um, le jeu électronique, so it's um, not very um, visible maybe in the picture, but this is some sort of electronic game, so maybe um, not necessarily a video game. I'm not sure that you would use that word. Um, le tiroir is a drawer. La bibliothèque is the word that we're using for this bookcase. You might also see the word étagère um, in a later slide. Les magazines, um, les chaussons, uh, I don't think we learned slippers yet when we learned um, clothes here. Le pyjama, um, la couette here is the, the quilt or blanket. Um, la guitare, l'oreiller, l'oreiller is your word for um, pillow. And the, oh, here's le lit, le lit is your word for the bed. Le réveil is an alarm clock. Et la chaise. Ça, c'est un chair. Dans la salle de séjour, or dans le salon, here's some things um, that you might see um, in a living room. Une plante, un tabouret, une chaise, un canapé, une cheminée, une table basse, une table, une décoration, un fauteuil, une étagère, in bibliothèque. And I would use étagère also for this type of shelf. So it may depend on um, what, who you're talking to, which French speaker, what word they prefer. Here are a few more words um, just related to the house in general, maybe the, the actual building. So um, le toit is the roof. L'entrée would be the entrance. La fenêtre the window, the jardin, obviously is the yard. Um, we talked about l'immeuble um, previously, um, the word for a building, especially an apartment building. Um, and then l'ascenseur is the elevator. And here's how we count the um, floors in a French building. We have le rez-de-chaussée, and then we start counting premier étage, deuxième étage, troisième étage, so um, we have sort of the ground floor, and then we start counting one, two, three. La porte is the door. La clé is the key. La plante, we've seen just a moment ago. And le balcon, I think we've seen already. Et il est dans sa chambre. He's in his room. Excellent. Merci de votre attention. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for listening.